Hi everyone, Kevin Torgerson here with the Olmsted County Sheriff's Office. 2021 is over. Whew. We made it through this eventful year. COVID has tried to rule the year and in many ways still has shaped our lives and will continue into the near future. But 2021 with vaccinations and better understanding of the virus has allowed us to get back with our families and friends and most activities. This year brought us many retirements, which we got a lot of new faces joining our office. 2021 also saw our deputies handle numerous life-saving and critical events throughout our community and state with civil unrest in the Metro to the daily needs in supporting public safety in Olmsted County. Our VSET, the Violent Crime Enforcement Team, has unfortunately seen their busiest and most complicated year in combating illegal trafficking of drugs in our communities. Our office continued the very important work in training our staff to be ready for all eventualities, including ongoing training related to implicit and explicit bias, cultural relevance, mental crisis, and de-escalation. Another topic that rose to the top of our discussion was the need for recruitment and retention of our staff. With the retirements we are seeing and the atmosphere around law enforcement, we are finding it more and more difficult to generate applications for open positions. This is something not unique to our office, but the profession in general. We need good people with high character and the desire to help our communities. Please encourage our young people to investigate law enforcement and detention as a profession to help and serve our communities. 2021 allowed us to participate in many activities, all with COVID safe planning, and we look forward to these events next year, like in February, the Polar Plunge is back, Safe City Nights, the Olmsted County Fair, and other community events, the Salvation Army bell ringing, Toys for Tots, Shop of the Cop, Coffee for Champions, and many, many more. See you next year. 2021 also marked a year where we are experiencing increased numbers of traffic fatalities across the state. Nearly 500 families are missing at least one loved one during this holiday season. Our efforts in traffic enforcement and public safety awareness will not fade. We are dedicated to keeping all of us safe and we need your help. Here in Southeast Minnesota, 37 lives have been lost compared to 50 last year but the state numbers have skyrocketed. Join me in committing to a safer 2022 by not drinking and driving, putting your phone down, slowing down, and the easiest thing of all, wearing your seatbelt. We can and must do this together. Lastly, 2021 also saw tragedy hit our office hard in April when Detention Deputy Mark Anderson lost his life to a sudden heart attack in the detention center on April 15th. Mark, as a gentle giant of a man, was a perfect fit for working in the facility with our detainees and staff. Mark is missed greatly by his family, friends, and coworkers, and will never be forgotten. So from me and the Olmsted County Sheriff's Office, we wish you a happy, safe, and successful new year. God bless everyone.